Can you write, deliver us from evil? To be delivered is to overcome sin. In other words, we will face a challenge. And that challenge you want us to see. And a challenge in your core, no senior. It takes God to make us to overcome that sin. So that we must not do evil. How can you overcome sin? Oh, to be delivered out from evil. The first thing, you must have awareness. Awareness of that sin. You need to know where you are entangled. If you want God to deliver you from evil, know the sin that devil wants you to commit. Awareness brings conf confession. The moment when we know that sin, if God wants to deliver you, the awareness of that sin will help us to distance ourselves. We cannot entertain ourselves with something that we know it affects our spirit. The Bible says, Resist the devil, he will flee. In other words, go, go away from him. Distance yourself. Make sure that you don't participate. Because you know that you will have a mandate to confess. It is very bad that you have to repeat confession all the time. As if your God is not faithful. As if God is not aware. God is aware with us. If God is aware of us, we have to be aware of our wrongdoings. And we have to be aware of his ability to forgive that sin. If we reach that level, we will always overcome that sin. He will deliver us from it. 1 Peter chapter 2. If we read from verse 11. So your awareness of the abilities of your body, the desires of your body, if you can know all of them, that the desires of your bodies are this. You'll be able to know you are not a stranger here. You will know that you are a stranger here. Amen. Amen. So listen to this. So it means your body wants to confide you here. Because if you are a stranger here. And your bodies want you to do things that affect your soul. Typically, it means you will be declaring yourself to be arrested here. I want to say it again. If truly you are strangers here, 
and your bodies are telling you to do things. And a million naira say you're ready to do it. That affect your soul. Jedi affect ang may ayari na. There will be no difference between your body and your soul. Oga sa tolo iba le papa no bil pibubare mi. So your soul will be arrested. Le moya jono may ayari na ito tani wa na mo. So sins are there. Jono the DVD thing. So that you'll be confined here. Pre we na yo uto udule na mo tani wa na mo. So now when awareness comes. Jono hati mo e u fiteji. It saved you. Ia u pulusa. It brings deliverance. It is so lukulua. And God will deliver you. And mudimu ta ulukulua kan niti buwing. The the more you do evil. Yano how you chana pili wena udia buwi. The more you do what your body wants. How you chana pili udia kamu home miliwa how ratang. You are also allowing God. Udu melahave ti mudim. To live you as you are. Or a out well. It is not easy to live a righteous life. Ah, oh no, lo pila bo pila bo bo khetwa. Because you are surrounded with wrong people. Karu dukulu hill we kaba tuwa basingbo. Allow God to deliver. To mela mo di mo lukulle. It's only God who will deliver you from evil. Ki mo di mo fela yata lukulang bo kopo. You are living with people. O pila leba atu. And these people. Batuba. Have to attract you. But don't you hold me? Have to challenge you. But challenge you. They have to compete. By perpetual way, na. Allow God to deliver you from evil. When I'm in my mother's womb, I'll look at the car of hope. If not, how is it alone? When your God comes, how would you want our feet? He won't be worshipped. I guess it's totally well to me. Otherwise, you are the one that can be used to destroy the faith. Matthew six verse thirteen. Arlebe lemo lo Matthew six verse thirteen. Remember whatever happened to you. Hope lang kam kache diya lang mogelena. It has been allowed by God. Did you make a tree? Or did you make a mudim? We need God to deliver us from evil. When temptation comes, it's a challenge for you to do it your way. I don't know if you are hearing me. Each and every one here. We have been given ability from God. We have been given We have been given ability from God. 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 The anointing in you help others. To joeling we na itusha baba we. And when you are helping others, God comes and help you. How unchi utusha baba gomu di muta atusha we na. Your solution. Kara boya how. Is coming from helping others. Ita fela how we na ukono utusha baba we. The level of the strength you need in life. Siemo samata we na wa tokan kara bo pilo. Where God will save you. Mo mu di muta upulusha. And deliver you. Au lukulla. Is coming from helping others. I want to tell you that if you try to use anointing to help yourself, that anointing is no longer not. It's magic. Whatever you try to demonstrate to make people to praise you, it doesn't bring deliverance on you. It brings praise on you. Did it all when our ready we come out? If it brings praise on you, then on hand did it all when our ready to give out? You are competing with God. We perpetually mudim. Because God is the only one that must be praised. Because mudimu ki analiti ya tunchura ready. Some of you are asking yourself. Baba mweri ipuchali di puchisho. Why when I'm faithful? Why kinchi kiti sebaye chi? I'm getting all this. And neki thola di loche kamoka. It's because you can't deliver yourself. Kikala bakala rokas kono te lukulla. It's God who have to deliver you from evil. What you are going through? It has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. Or let's say, it has been allowed for you. To go through it. To deliver. Or a heart of that fit how to look all. Now you will come out. Jano uto uta uchwelele. I pray that today. Kira pelar lechono. The Lord will deliver you. More na le look all. From evil. Karabu ubi. And if you reach there. And a how fit a kwale. Righteousness will be your portion. Tu uko ito ba karlo yabo pili. I want to share Corinthians. Kenya kule bonche taba yongo molo ba Corinth taba pili. If we read from ten. Arabe la uto verse ten. Chapter ten. Ba Corinth taba pili chapter ten. Verse thirty. Verse 13. Don't be surprised of what you are doing. Because it is not new. God has allowed that. God has allowed that. 
God allowed you to be poor. God allowed you to be the way you are. This is God for you. He has allowed it. He has allowed you to be born in that family. Where they didn't want you. Allowed you to marry that wife. To have those children to have sickness like this. this to go through what you are going through. There are some sins when you take one step it's a sin. But it will also lure you to another sin. It's better you stop there and you allow God to deliver you. Listen, remember the Bible says we must accept he is faithful and he will forgive us if we are not accepting we will find a wrong way out allow God himself to open a way for you if you believe him and that way will be of deliverance we get the strength of living a salvation life. So that when he comes to open the grave. will come out. The reasons why you are not coming out. You are not living a right life. You are not honest. To the mistake that you have done. You are carrying on. Try to deny. This is clear. When you are clean, clean. When he opens. You will receive a strength. And you will come out. I pray that you come out. I pray that you come out. I don't know if you are hearing me. The Spirit, the Spirit of God. Is searching for us somewhere. The Spirit of God is searching so that our God will be seen as God of battle. But Mara, we are in a wrong place where God doesn't want us to be. And we defend ourselves. Defend ourselves. Defend ourselves. And now you know, sin comes. We need God to deliver us from it. Luke 23, 39 to 43. Luke 23, verse 39 to 43. Normally, we go to people and accuse them. Without looking at our weakness. Without looking at our mistakes. Can you see, we need to start with ourselves. Before we accuse Jesus. Why my situation is like Jesus, if you are Jesus, save me. Jesus, you. Deliver me from this evil. This is the time you can say to God. Deliver me from it. I'm a sinner. I know I'm wrong. I'm mean, in this position because I didn't do right. I'm mean, in this challenge whether you are getting right or wrong. I have time to say, Lord, deliver me from this. Do you know that you people love to justify yourself? You love to justify yourself. You are not worthy to meet one, two, three. What you are going through, you question it. Why me? Why that? I want to tell you, God will allow any situation to come and test your faith. You are the one who can make sure that you don't do evil. There's an opportunity of defending yourself. In everyone's life, decide not to do evil. 
decide not decide to do evil. I don't know if you're hearing me. Can you see you reach a level where you are developing things. You are wasting time. You are wasting time. Satan draw you where he can love you. Allow God to deliver you from that. Allow God to deliver you. That's what I say, my friend. Where do you want God to deliver you? You become angry. Think about when you become angry, you say you don't want to eat food now. You don't want to eat food now. As if this food you are eating for someone. But this food must come to your own self. Oh Whatever devil is doing you is you want you to react. It's only weak people who react. Because reacting is coming without thinking. If you rethink, or you are able to foresee what will happen, you won't react. I don't, I don't know if you're hearing me. Because at the end of the day, that action will cause you. It will cause you to see God again. First John 2. John Ewapili chapter 2. Verse 20. Verse 20. You have anointing. Lena lito ucho. That anointing illuminates you. Tocho ye idira oru wena yusukis. Bring awareness. Iti sate muho mawena. Devil will never challenge you. Satan akastu wa uchallenge ile. But the people would not matter to you. Kava tu basi nengta babasi nengse singwe mawena. Devil will use people. Satan will you use You have anointing. And that anointing teaches you. You will be able to dissect. So that you do what is right. The anointing when it comes upon you. It will make you to understand this is wrong. That one is right. I won't do this. I will do this. It's now that I know that many people you see same applies when God using people. Many advices are from Satan. If your anointing is weak, you can end up doing what Satan is saying. You need God to deliver you. If not, you can find yourself doing what Satan wanted to do. Many of our mistakes came from the voices of Satan. They look reasonable. But it is they are there to lure you to do evil. Maradi ho na rowe na uye sivi. Allow God to deliver you. Do mela mudi ma ulukule. Allow God to deliver. Do mela mudi ma vya na ulukule. Look at yourself. Go to level. When you are here, how le mo? You start to hear this another man. Utomo tabara una le mo na tsuko. You uproot yourself. When I want to mula, you go and plant yourself. Wa sepila wa etijola ke uwe. All the effort you put there are wasted. You start from a fish. You uproot yourself. You plant yourself. Because I want this spiritual father. Thinking that this spiritual father when he comes. Maybe I will have a gift to prophesy. It's not coming from the spiritual father. Allow God to deliver you from the spiritual father. Allow God to deliver you from the spiritual father. Your faithfulness. It's a promotion. It's a level of greatness. I pray that today. God will lift you. God will lift you. God will lift you. I pray that today. God will lift you. 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 God will lift
you are hearing certain talking. Oh, that's Satan Because when you look at yourself, <laughs> you are seeing stagnation. Oh, Not knowing that the stagnation <laughs> is overflow in the spirit. <laughs> what you are seeing <laughs> in the <laughs> is opposite in the spirit. <laughs> because you believe <laughs> the one you believe. <laughs> and he's the one who's taking <laughs> you. I you see some people here do not allow any challenge to give you direction. Allow God to guide you. As allow God to guide you. He's delivering you from evil. As he's delivering you from evil. I want to tell you. God wants to deliver you. Do not use your power. I said, do not use your power. God will do that for you. God bless you. God bless you.